What is going on, Subnauts? Draco Invictus here. And uh, yes, we are taking a dive into Subnautica tonight. Random Boy and Pixie, what is going on? Welcome to the stream. Welcome, everybody. Uh, we are playing, it's a new to me game. Uh, this game's actually been out uh, for quite a while now. It went into early access in 2014. Uh, with a retail release in 2018 so a four year early access period and then they re uh, released i is it a dlc maybe it's uh like part two like sub-zero that whole thing i don't have that but um but i do have the the actual game subnautica here so hey mikey what's going on dalton how you doing buddy uh, so we're gonna dive in uh, truth be told, I played about an hour of the game last night uh, just to kind of get my bearings, kind of understand the basic mechanics of the game. Didn't get too far, but that was not the goal. It was just to kind of figure out what the hell am I supposed to be doing? So, um, so I, I, I have some idea, but uh, we are going to play this thing out and uh, we're going to see how it goes. All right, Mikey says, nice, relaxing game. That is the feel that I got from it as well. Mikey just kind of swimming around, looking at all the little fishies and then snatching them up so I could, you know, eat something. Yeah. <laughs> Go deeper. Yep. I, I actually went uh, really, I went over 200 meters deep and I did not make it out alive. And then it was like 11 o'clock at night. And I was like, okay, I think I should probably go to bed because I could sit here all night playing with the game. So um, I, I really, really did enjoy it. Uh, I did inch toward the ship and started getting radiation there, random boy. So I know exactly what you're talking about. <laughs> that is definitely what she said. You know what? Let's go ahead and um, we're going to hit the intro and then we'll get into this. Let's do it. Let's jump into game time here. Oh, okay. Well, don't ruin it for me, random. Thousand meters. Wow. All right. So as you can see, I have no save files. I, I didn't even save what I did last night at all because it was just like, let's go swim around. So let's start a new game. And of course, we are going to start. Uh, they do offer different game modes, survival, freedom, hardcore, and creative. Uh, obviously creative build anything with no uh, constraints oxygen food pressure story death disabled a uh, hardcore uh, survival mode with only one life no o2 alerts that seems a little bit too brutal for my first time out freedom like survival but without hunger and thirst well no i i like the challenge so we're just gonna go with survival here graphically this game is just gorgeous All right, good to know. Uh, you should be able to. Uh, it's just the loading screen, so let me uh, get over here and fix that really quick. But yes, you should have been able to see it by now. Uh, I am so glad you said something because I just wasn't paying attention. There we go. Um, and let's call this. There we go. And there. There we go. Drop that in there. Turn that one off. Now my overlays are good. All right, here we go. I mean, again, didn't miss anything. It was nothing but the opening little splash screen where it does the little percentage count up, so. You beat the game in 13 hours, Mikey? Wow. Oh, 
Don't you lie to me, Pixie. That's not nice. Oh, okay. I got gotcha. you. Little red fish. Liar. You lie. <laughs> you lie like a cheap rug, Pixie. Come on. All right. Uh, yeah. Put away the iPad. <laughs> Let's pick up the fire extinguisher and put all this out. Oops. Getting a little too close there. There we go. All right. I guess. Oh, I. Go out, damn spot. Are we done now? There we go. Yeah. No, I ran into them last night. I was looking for sulfur. You have suffered minor head trauma. No kidding. I caught that plate in the face. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive. On an alien world, please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. What's up, Baba Ganoush? Oh man, I'm I'm just full of puns today. Let me tell you, I'm very punny. All right, uh, so let's uh, let's start with uh, uh, taking a look here. Uh, our we need to eat something, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. Uh, we're gonna grab uh, one of those. And you will see this often tonight because I know I'm going to do it a bunch. That is what you're going to see because I'm so used to hitting escape to get out of whatever screen I'm in the iPad, for instance, I know it's tab, but I still always hit escape. So, and, um, our health looks good right now. So I'm not going to worry about that. Let us uh, go outside for any of you that haven't noticed or uh, haven't seen how gorgeous this game is. Let's take a look. Yep, that's a lot water. Save the nutrient bars, got it. All right, into the water we go. Our first little deep dive. And we're already collecting crap. I love how they laugh after they totally gas out like that. Take the meds from the box. Yes, um, I did learn that as well because they do uh, replenish over time. So it's like every time you go back to the the life pod, go ahead and, and get you get you some health. And we're already running out of air. Man, I need to make a tank. Oh, there's I guess there's a lot of things. I did get the sulfur, yes. After uh, the the jump scare of the stupid ass fish exploding in my face, uh, we'll pick up a couple of those. Oh, look at this! Break limestone. Woohoo! I can make a battery. Your probability of survival has just decreased to unlikely, but plausible. Well, at least it's uh, but plausible now. An area by where you get deep this. Uh, oh, nice. Okay. Ah, uh, it was just getting good. The floaters are cool. I haven't figured out what to do with them yet. But I did gather some up. I couldn't figure out what to do with them, so. I'm sure I'll figure it out in time. Might as well snatch all of this up and then get back up to the surface. All right, come here, little bladder fish. I'm going to collect a few of you. Let's put that away. 
Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Just gonna keep going out here until my inventory fills up, then we'll swim back to the, the pond. Plasman! How's it going? Ooh, silver. Nice. That's a great early find. Because I only found one and it was after about 50 minutes in the game. And then I died shortly thereafter, so. But I, I was looking at some of the recipes or, or blueprints or whatever. And um, there were a couple that I was like, man, I need to get that. But it required silver, so. What the hell was that that I just picked up? I don't know. Let's take a look. Oh, it was just titanium. See, I did it again already, guys. I warned you. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I know. Oxygen. Oxygen, oxygen, oxygen. And we're almost full. I've got, I doubt I have room for much else. I mean, a couple small things, I suppose. Maybe a couple more fish or something that I can eat. Oh, come here, peeper. Gotcha. There's probably more fish than I'm going to need, but... Oh, I don't have enough air for that. All right, I'm going. And, ooh. Ah, there it is. I suppose I can put the little fishy away. If I was trapped on an unknown planet, I'd die in five seconds. Yeah, <laughs> fair enough. Yep, I know I need a knife. Um, That is one of the things that I need to be building. All right, so let's start here. Um, let's see. We can build a battery, which is something that we definitely need. And we can actually build a second battery. Um, I probably should build that. I'm going to need it. And I'll just stow it away until I can use it later. All right, um, let's see here. Let's, uh, we got those bladder fish, so let's go ahead and make some water bottles out of them. That sounds wonderful, huh? Turning a fish into water. Yummy. All right, now we'll cook these guys up. I don't think I picked up any salt, so yeah, I can't cure anything yet. Man, I guess I picked up a few fish. All right, um, let's see. Equipment. Uh, we need to make a standard O2 tank. Um, I don't think so. I saw something when I was swimming at night. They were pretty large, but I haven't met like a single large entity. But these things were pretty massive. I mean, scared the crap out of me, so... We get busy on the titanium front here. Yeah, I've learned that titanium is like the thing that you need to build with, so. All right, so what do we need here? We need uh, two glass and, of course, the standard O2 tank that we already made. But we have the silver ore and we have the titanium. So that is definitely something that we're going to want to get. And then for tools, we got our scanner. So. It was at night. I'm not exactly sure. No, that's just the scanner. What can I make in here? Oh, the copper wire. I guess um, we'll hold off on the copper wire now because I may need the copper ore for something else. So I'm going to hold on to that for now. Um, let's go ahead and stow 
all this freaking titanium. And we'll go ahead and store the copper and the silver, the battery. And uh, let's go ahead and we're going to eat the fishes. Mmm, crunchy. There we go. Now our food's back up. That thing should hold out for a little while longer. All right. I think we're good now. Nice, Baba Ganoush. I, I just downloaded it uh, because it's available on Game Pass. And I was like, hmm, I'll check that out. Seems like a different kind of a survival game. You know, has some sort of like base building element thing going on. I was like, then I played it last night for, like I said, an hour or so. And I was like, oh, yeah, we're definitely going to do something with this. All right, so now that we have our trusty scanner, back into the water we go. Because we also have an air tank. Ooh, I love this at night. This game is so gorgeous at nighttime. Just scan the weed. Really? There we go. Obviously, you need a flashlight to really kind of make all this happen. It would be cool if you could pull up blueprints while you weren't in the lifeboat, like on your little PDA or whatever. This guy's just swimming along. Come here. Thank you. Uh, this is it did such a beautiful job. Oh, salvage. Hello Oxygen. Yeah, I know Really just stay above water for a second. Thank you. All right, let's skin the creep vine. Cool. Now we'll come down here and get some of these. Oh, I can scan the clusters too. There we go. You know, these take up a lot of space in the inventory. Yeah, four spaces, so. And I haven't watched anything about this game so far. So, like, I haven't looked up any videos or anything like that. I wanted to kind of go into this as cold as possible. Hey, slacker. Joshy Washy. How's it going? All right. I was looking for one of those brain coral things. Looks like we're going to have to... Head topside for our air. A four hour run. Wow. All right. Back down we go. Yeah, I mean, because it, it would be easy for a game that's been out as long as this one has. I mean, early access started in 2014, for God's sakes. Um, it'd be very, very easy to um, to get everything that I ever wanted to know. Need a knife for those. Thirty minutes. Wow. That's crazy. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Oh. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during Planet Four. It's definitely a lot easier exploring during the daytime now, that's for sure.
but it is pretty at night that's there's no denying that And they take a long time to scan. Thirty seconds. All right, better get back up to the top. Definitely want to explore that a little bit more. I'm working on it. Short range scans suggest this bio supports extensive biodiversity and connects to a number of small cave networks. Well, I, I watched like, like a couple of the trailers that they had released for the game. That, I mean, nothing with any like like, here's what you do, here's where you need to go, kind of a thing. I didn't watch anything like that. I wanted the, the exploration to be totally on, oh, nothing in that box. Totally on me, you know? It's a shame you can't collect all that, or any of it, really. Thirty seconds. Yeah, I know. You little shit. See, I swear they laugh when they gas out. Come here, I just want to scan you. Got him. All right. Exactly. What the hell is that? Oh, that's just one of the the fartipods. Ah, uh, here we go. Some more rocks. Let's go bang on some rocks. Dude, don't be gassing me out, man. That's not cool. Hmm, got some more copper. Ah, scrap. Oxygen. I'm working on it. Oh, you got some. Ooh, the sea glide fragment. Yes. We need to pick up more of those. The hell was that? Was it a fish? Oh, no, there it is. Veined nettle. And I'm just swimming my ass off. Is 
Did what not scare me? Alright, let's get down here. Ah, here we go. See, you're gonna be my best friend, Brain Coral. Remember where that guy is, huh? I feel like just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Where the hell's Nemo? Get some quartz so I can make some glass. Oh, I didn't want to pick that up. Swim. He, he popped, didn't he? There we go. Oh, inventory. Oh, gold with inventory full. What am I dropping? I'm dropping that stupid egg. Give me the gold. Thank you very much. All right. Now let's get out of here. If I don't die, that would suck. I just get the gold. All right. Time to swim my happy ass back. Well, I am always happy to assist, true? I do, Josh. It is uh, down in the description below. This is incredibly peaceful. I mean, I know there's the, the moments when the little fish jump out at you and crap like that. Or the bigger fish jump out at you. <laughs> This is a very interesting and different take on like a survival kind of a game. All right. So what do we need? Uh, oh yeah, we need a glass. So let's make some glass. And we also need silicone rubber. Need a couple of those. And we'll go ahead and, uh, I guess we'll cook up the rest of this titanium. You don't lose everything, but I do know that you do lose something from your inventory. I haven't been able to figure out what I lost, but I know that it does happen. All right, so those are done. Um, I think I would, did I make two silicone rubber? I probably need to make some lubricant as well. Not that kind of lubricant, fellas. All right. Um, let's see here. If we come over here, oh, we can make the fins. That's exactly what I wanted there. And um, looks like we need to make another glass. We need to get some more quartz. And we have everything else, so. Uh, but under tools, can we make the knife? Yes. Okay, so we can make the repair tool. That's fantastic. And we can also make the survival knife. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Braxis Prime. 
the knife remains the only exception. Now, can you break it down? I don't think you can break down a titanium ingot. But that would certainly take up less space, I suppose, than having, because it takes 10 titanium. So, all right, I'm officially asking those of you that have played, is it better to kind of compress my titanium into titanium ingots? Maybe leave a few individuals, but for the most part, just go with the ingots. I'm, go ahead and leave that down in the, in the chat down there. Let's uh, get this thing repaired here. Oh, really? That's a lot of hours. All right. Ship is fixed. Let's go ahead and get our med kit out so that I can start going. We'll tuck that away. So you're saying ingots, huh? All right. Fair enough. Because I have a wee bit of titanium here. So let's uh, collect what we can. Ah, I did it again. I'm telling you guys, you're going to have to see that all night long. So that, that took up 10 titanium and ingots only takes up a single spot. Yeah, that's, yeah, we're definitely going to do that a little bit more. Because we have a crap ton of titanium right now. I know it's not a lot in, in the grand scheme of things. It's not a lot, but for the limited space that we have right now, it's a lot. All right, so uh, every damn time. Um, I suppose I could turn all those, but I think I will leave those as uh, singulars right now. Uh, that's our one glass. We need more uh, quartz. Took all that away. I don't need the fire extinguisher when I'm out swimming around. Uh, we'll go ahead and grab the waters. We'll leave one of these here. We're gonna eat this fish. Drink some water. Oops, that's storing the water. There we go. Vital signs stabilizing. Ooh, way hydrated now. All right. So um, just in case of emergencies, uh, we do have our first aid kit and a nutrient block. But uh, we are now we have a knifty knife. And I want to move this into slot one. Let's bind that to one. There we go. And then we'll bind this to three. All right, much better. And now we can harvest some stuff like right now. I haven't found anything for the, um, the writhing weed yet. And we'll, we'll get some of this table coral here. There we go. Perfect. 30 seconds. Yeah, yeah, I know. Picking up some quartz. Don't bug me, I'm playing. All right, Oop. we'll get this one rock over here. Yep, all right. Swim. Mike Caden, thanks for the sub. I appreciate it. All right. So, I think we now have everything that we need. Because we needed two glass and we were only able to make one before, so. 
So now if we come back over here and we're, we needed uh, titanium, like four. Uh, we'll get the glass. What else do we need? Uh, we needed... Oh, maybe I need another silver or did I only need one silver? That's a great question. Oh, the standard O2 tank. Cool. Easy. That we can do. All right. Now we have our high capacity, 135 seconds. That's awesome. Now we can swim for longer. Let's check our inventory here. Um, let's go ahead and put that stuff away for now. All this away. Yeah, there we go. And our inventory is full. Oh, ah, every damn time. I may have to make one of them floaty little storage things. All right. And of course, it's got to be nighttime now. Ow, that's not very nice. I guess I don't need to scan it if I cut some off, huh? Hey, Mark Jackson, how you doing, buddy? Yes, I, I'm enjoying it. It's very tranquil, except for when the fish try and kill me. That's not so tranquil. All right, looking for more crash sites, of course, more debris. It's a whole lot easier to do that. Oh, that's sure. Coral shell plates. Kind of hard to do that at night, but. I was bummed to find out that there's some fish that even after you kill them, you can't take them. So that's, that's not cool. Oh yeah, I'm excited about the deep dives. That's for sure. Oxygen. I went just over, uh, I went like 200 meters. That's as deep as I went last night when I was just kind of first playing with the game. Ah, uh, fiber mesh. All right, and what can we make in here? Ah, uh, first aid kits. Don't need to worry about that. Because, oh, that's only at 75%. All right. So I suppose we can convert this titanium. Let's just get that out of here. All right, now we'll make some ingot. All right, now we've pretty much made everything that we can other than the first aid kits. We're saving the fiber mesh for something else. Thank you very much. I don't remember what I'm saving it for, but. Oh, I know what it's for. Never mind. All right, um, I guess we need to pull these out so we can turn them into ingots. Put that away. 
I don't, how many do I need? I need 10. All right, and I only have four. So it looks like I'm gonna be carrying a couple of those for a little bit. There we go. Online, yes, daylight approaches. of the Aurora's drive core may result in a quantum detonation continuing to monitor there we go oh we have a new radio transmission Don't attack me, fish. New blueprint acquired. Life there. on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. Just under a minute. New creature discovered. Thirty seconds. Yeah, I know. working on all right and back down we go He's gonna come get me. Oh, dodged him. Ooh. See, you got all upset and you left your little sulfur plant exposed. No, don't want the eggs right now. That's just gonna take up space that I don't have. Uh, you can just not yet. I know that you can put up like buoys or, or markers or some transponder thing or something like that. Yeah, it'd be a bummer if I was just swimming around in circles, huh? <laughs> seconds uh, there's some more gear down there definitely want to go down there yeah that's what i'm hoping mark and yeah, this seems like a very cool game something that you can just kind of chill and just do Show a nearby cave entrance, depth 90 meters. 
leading to an unknown environmental and that's when i went down for 200 meters how full am i huh we can still there come on now I don't blame her. I think it's gorgeous. Anything in there? No. I don't know what that fish was doing. He was not happy about it though. to find another brain coral thing but yeah oh yeah there they are Oxygen. swim your ass off go 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 oh barely gonna make it Ugh. yeah those are the things that I saw. Are you going to eat me? Reef back. Oh, come on now. All right, fine. Scan the red wart. I get it. All right. Cool. Ah, oh, there. There's a brain coral. What is this? Ah, oh, score. Furled Papyrus. There we go. All right, any more coral on this guy? No, that's an acid mushroom. Oh, there's one. Break the barnacle. Nice. Does I feel better? <laughs> Alright, let's go check out the next one. Yeah, that's how you make uh, batteries, huh? How full am I? Good. We can keep going. Are they mating? Am I interrupting? I'm sorry. There we go. 
Wow, I'm really close to the surface there. Didn't even, <laughs> I wasn't even paying attention to my depth. All right. Oh, we're not quite full yet. Might as well stay out. What did that say? Rogue Cradle. That's cool. I guess I can't actually scan these guys, huh? That's just terrifying. <laughs> Almost reminds me of the the creatures. Um, a mission to Farpoint. See how many of you get that reference, huh? All right. So now that we're done playing with the Leviathan. Oh, we got a, a big chunk of salvage over here. Hopefully we have enough air to... Ah, oh, we should. Hopefully the fish don't eat us. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Anything to scan around here? Yeah, I, we definitely need to come back over here. There's a lot of salvage. All right, 77 seconds. Nope, can't get in that way. Nope. Can't find a way in. Man, we've been out a whole freaking day already. Yeah, I know. Yes. The very first two episodes of Star Trek The Next Generation. All right, I guess we can put the scanner away now. Except those creatures weren't underwater. All right. Do we have anything good? Tell me something good. We can make more glass. Yeah. Battery, lubricant, copper wire. We have all of those things except for the copper wire, which, well, we can make right now. Because over here, we happen to have, you have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by battery, lubricant. Data indicates that swimming was your favorite activity. It was not my favorite activity. Let's not do that. Sea glide. There we go. Converts torque into thrust into water via propeller. Heck yeah. Now we can go faster. The sea glide will increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. All right, so we got that done. Uh, let's go ahead and make up some... Uh, Fish. Oh, we should have grabbed some uh, some bladder fish. I know. That's what I was just saying.
All right, so that's all done. We could make more copper wire if we wanted to. And a flare. All right, so. Can we make copper ingots or does that, do we even need to do that? No, I guess not. All right. I guess I can make some bleach. Let's do that. I knew I gathered these up for some reason. Because I'm sure I have a little bit of... Yeah, I got some salts. I swear they're just going to nerf that game into extinction right there. Oh, I totally forgot the, about the other radio. So now we have bleach. Receiving pre-recorded distress call laying back. This is LifePod 3 uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide. So if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. All right. So how do we use the bleach? We have bleach to make water. Is it is something over here? Ah, there we go. Water. That makes sense. Ensure against dehydration and eventual death. Nice. Eight bottles of water for four bleach? That's cool. Because I need some right now. Vital signs stabilizing. Hmm. Chewy. There we go. Water is full. All right, so now let's tuck um, all this stuff away. Well, as much as we can, I suppose. What do I need to make the little... Um, I just need four titanium. Fair enough. After I just converted them all. Oh, no, look. There we go. All right, now we have a little place where we could store some shit. Uh, we'll hold on to the waters because we're going to use our little sea glide thing here. So that'll work. Let's do it. I haven't used one of these yet. Wow. I dig how it's like mapping like the terrain and stuff like that. That's cool. I suppose we could go check out the pond over there, huh? I'm going to get stuck, aren't I? Ah, oh, no. We got plenty of power. Eventually, I'm going to have to figure out how to make a, like a compass or something. <laughs> so I know at least like a relative direction of where I'm heading. Man, this thing cruises. Uh-oh. That's not good. 
the hell was that? Whoa! You're a big nasty, aren't you? Nope. Definitely no good. Hey, new blueprint compass. I just talked about that. No, I've never been over here before. <laughs> I did not get this far as far as like getting building stuff. All right, so I need to um, let's get out of here. We'll go back a little bit closer to home now. A compass? They're pretty cheap, man. All right, sounds good. Yeah, I'm sure there's lots of things that I'm going to need. Local radiation readings suggest the Aurora's drag core has reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours. Ah, cool. You can definitely got to watch that, huh? See, I collected everything from here because it's not too far from the... Oh, my water jet, yes. Yeah, these things would be a blast, huh? I suppose I don't need to be using it all the time. I'm, like, close to the pod here. Yeah, I'm 87 meters away. Let's go ahead and tuck that away for now save the power but we do need air Come here, Mr. Peeper. And might as well grab up a bladder fish or two. Grab some boomerang things. And yeah, we're gonna eat well tonight. We're gonna sit back, get some popcorn, watch the ship blow. Let's see. Oh, what do we have in here? Oh, laser cutter. I already have one of those. Don't I have one of those? Maybe I don't. Oh, no, that's the repair tool that I have. Sucks. Yeah, I know. All 
Oh, she's not gonna blow yet. Actually, Oh, I can't cut it to open yet. I need the, I guess I need the, the laser cutter that it was just talking about, huh? Oh, there we go. Right tool for the right job. The sea moth. That's like a like an actual like submersible, huh? No, nothing in that one. Nothing in that one. Definitely need to come back over here, though. Yeah, I know. Thirty seconds. make it no keep going go 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 no 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 ah oh. are you kidding me <laughs> wow that was crazy all right <laughs> so um let's uh go cook something to eat yep that's <laughs> Yeah, that was absolutely insane. <laughs> All right. Fabricator, let's, um, we need food first. Actually, I should, probably shouldn't do the cure. That makes me dehydrated more. Oh, no, not the bladder fish. No. Damn it. That was supposed to be my water. All right. Well, now I have some foods to eat. Note for later. Always make the water first. Okay. So let's... Um... So what do we need for the compass? Copper wire wiring kit. Ooh, a wiring kit. Okay, deployables. See gun, uh, let's see, waterproof, mobile vehicle bay. And what do we need for that? That oh we need to pick up uh, no, that's a habit. There it is. Laser cutter. Oh, I need to find one more so that I can unlock the blueprints. There are, but I have to make them. I think that's under equipment. Where is it? They're around here somewhere. Tools. There it is. Air bladder. So, yeah, I definitely need to... <laughs> Because I will get myself into trouble. <laughs> that is exactly what I will do. Calorie intake recommended. Yeah, yeah, I know. Let's eat our fishes. There we go. Get a little drink there. Oh, yeah. Feeling a whole lot better. All right. So, uh, blueprints. Do, 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 do. Rebreather is definitely something else I want, but it also requires a wiring kit. Yeah, see, we're two out of three for the laser cutter.
So we need a power cell, not a battery. But I have to make a mobile vehicle bay first, which means that I probably need to set up a base first, right? Is that how that goes? But hey, we could do a bioreactor. Yeah, just throw together a few pieces of titanium, a wiring kit and some lubricant. All right, so we've actually like unlocked like a bunch of different stuff here. That's yes, I know the radio. What the hell, guys? They didn't warn us this might happen. Our pod was almost crushed by the Seamoth Bay on the way down. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim-looking snake thing's trying to eat through the hull. Come get us already. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Ah, cool. Is this thing gonna blow or what? No need for base. Cool. All right, so I guess let's figure out what we need. Oh, ingredients unknown because I haven't figured it out yet. That's what the deal is. Yeah, I got to scan one more. So maybe if I head over We'll head over to that other marker. Which is where? Oh, right there. 465. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do for them. They're under attack. What the? Oh. Those are very weird looking birds. All right. So I guess we'll just go collect resources. I, I definitely want to be topside when that thing blows, though. go this way all right cool What the hell? Are they gonna hurt us? No, oh, we made it in. Now, how did that metal salvage get in here? we have here oh there it is <laughs> just what we wanted 30 seconds all right fine I'll head back up It's dark around here early, man. Yeah, I definitely need a flashlight for those nighttime swims.
Hi, Jessica Smith. Welcome to the stream. Whoa, easy there, big fella. Oh, there it is. Emergency. A quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state in T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Oh, catching rads. Ah, now we get the radiation suit. All right, cool. Good to know. See, this is what I was looking for earlier. I uh, didn't like that, huh? New A hoop fish. Oh, that thing wasn't nice. Come on, Mr. Stalker, where'd you go? I thought it was, oh, there he is. Damn, my inventory is full. All right, so let's uh, head back to the life pod. Ooh, 189. Oh, no, not to the Aurora. Yeah, no. I suppose I can put that away right now. All right, so let's see, what do we need? Fiber mesh times two. I think we only have one right now. Yeah, we have one right now. So um, let's uh, make up some um, some food, some water. Get rid of these uh, titanium pieces. All right, water first. Lots of different fish to eat. Now, if you cure them, do they last longer? Is that what the deal is? So I need lubricant and a power cell. So how do I make a power cell? Requires two batteries and silicone rubber. All right. So I need more acid mushrooms. Nice. Because I have a, I should have a ton of copper. I do.
And I also need... Let's see, where do I need to go? I think it's over here. Yep. Did I already harvest that one? Or is my inventory so full? Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> All right, uh, so let's uh, go make up some batteries. All right, um, let's tuck um, these away for now so we can pick up those. Uh, All right, so now all we need is the silicone rubber, which we should have in here. Or do we use it all? Um, oh, you know what? I may have put it down here. Nope, looks like I need to make some. Okay. You can't hold very much of that stuff, can you? No, it's huge. Ah, oh, no, that's the fiber mesh. Ugh. I need the seed clusters. That's what I need. Well, at least I had the right idea. Let's put, um, we can put the salt away. Try this again. Damn inventory always full. Um, ch -ch -ch. all right, we got three. It's better than one. All right, just keep swimming. So now deployables. We can make the power cells and then we have the lubricant. So Ooh, those are big. Oh, okay. Nice. I imagine we'll need more power cells, so So now what are we missing? Oh, the lubricant. Yes. Raw 
rock and roll. Let's go put this thing out, huh? So, we need more lubricant, titanium ingot, right? Because the Seamoth, that's what we're trying to make here. So, titanium ingot, one more glass, and one more lubricant. Awesome. There's the glass. Now we need to go get more of the little things to, uh, and let's put uh, these away and we'll grab that. And now we just need to make more lubricant. Everyone following along with the rest of the class? Excellent. Because school's in session. Oh, that was bad. So bad. And as always, the inventory is full. I suppose I could drop these because these are easy to pick up. So let's do that because I'd much rather. All right, we were able to get one more. I guess I only needed to drop one. And another radio transmission? All right. All right, all right, all right. There. Now we have plenty of lubricant. We should have everything we need. The Seamoth is a fast, safe mode of transport. But remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. Yeah, I'll remember that. Hell yeah. Welcome aboard, Captain. <laughs> Ooh, got my own submarine. So I guess we can zip over here now. This thing have guns on it? Probably not. Oh, that's it, huh? All right. I don't, I, well, oh, wait, no, I can get more resources if I scan that. All right, what else is around here since we're over here, right? Uh, we'll pick up one more salt. We don't need a bunch of salt right now. Because I have like three or four pieces of the house. The house. <laughs> oh, 
yes. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Perfect. Now we can do the laser cutter. Yeah, 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 I know. That's salt. We do need some more bladder fish, though. So we'll keep our eyes open for that. All right. Better get back over here to the sea moth. Oxygen. I know I'm working on it. All right. That was pretty awesome. Hey, get me a, an achievement. There's something in here. Oh. What is this? Ah, creature egg. We'll skip on that. I would dive deep, but unfortunately I'm not going to have a lot of uh, space to put anything, so... We can see anything else just kind of floating around here. Those fish are just not nice. How do I put stuff in it? It just says enter Seamoth. Underneath or something? That's the power cell. How do I store stuff? No, that doesn't work. Ah. Uh, I'm guessing so, because everywhere I point, it just says enter CMOP or the, the power cell. No, it's all right. Definitely worth taking a look at, you know? So, all right. So we need to head back this direction, but we'll keep our eye out for like debris. Maybe we can scan some stuff. I just love playing with the metal debris, huh? Our water's getting kind of low. So let's, um, 
I mean, we're right here. So let's just kind of see if we can't find a couple bladder fish. I suppose we could put him away. <laughs> Yeah, you definitely go through a lot more water than you do food, from what I've noticed. All right. I want to welcome all the new viewers. Welcome, everybody. And I appreciate all the likes. I like looking up and seeing lots of likes. So that's nice. Thank you. All right. So what do we need? Uh, we need fiber mesh. Which, of course, we need to always make more of that. Oh, look, we can make a wiring kit. Awesome. We need one of those. What do we need one of those for? Who remembers? I don't remember. Oh, it's the rebreather. Nice. I think that's what I wanted it for. There's something else that we wanted it for. Is it the laser cutter? No. Oh, that requires two diamond. Ugh, I haven't even found any diamond. The hell's a propulsion cannon? All right, I think I'm going to make the rebreather. So, and it should have put it on me. Yep, there it is. Now, what did we need the table coral for? Oh, okay, good. So it is like, like an actual cannon cannon. All right. I totally forgot I had this water in here. Let's go ahead and drink this water. Let's get back up to full. Eat that guy. I shouldn't have, but... There we go. Um, let's see here. So we need to make another fiber mesh so that we can make the radiation suit. Because we have one and I think we need two. Yep, we need two. So let us just go. Hey, Agent RD. Welcome. Ah, here we go. There is something in there. More titanium. That's all I'm going to get. It's always what I'm going to get. Yeah, I, I played just a little bit last night and um, didn't even save my progress. I'm like, yeah, let's do this. All right. Fiber mesh. Awesome. Now we are going to, oh, 
before it goes bad, let's go ahead and turn this. Let's do the silicone rubber. All right, so let's grab the other fiber mesh out of here. Now we should be able to make the radiation suit. Uh, you know what? Now that you mention that, <laughs> there we go. Yeah, because I had not saved at all, and I've been streaming for an hour and forty, almost an hour and forty-five minutes. So. Our health is at full, and we just got another kit. I I forgot to check last time, but we'll go ahead and tuck that away. I guess I'm going to have to make another little floaty thing. Another one of these. I'm just tired of not having any space. So you know what? Let's make two of them. Screw it. There. Okay. Let's see. Four. I suppose I, I need to carry that with me down the road. You won't have to worry about space at all. Yeah. And I kind of figured as much, this is just kind of like that, the beginning thing, but like once you get a base or something like that, you can kind of do a little bit more. Okay. So we have our radiation suit. We've got our rebreather. We've got our high capacity O2 tank. So I think that we are much more able to, um, Welcome aboard, Captain. thank you to maybe go exploring a little bit deeper, just around here. I mean, nothing crazy. It's probably not the right way, but. to make sure I didn't forget anything in any of these boxes. Nope, nothing in that one. Yeah, see, look, we come down here. Wow. Oh, ooh. big nasty eels. So let's, uh, we'll go ahead and get out. We got the old scanner. Oh, I'm sure I haven't. I, I'm still like in the intro phase around here. 171 meters. It's like thermal vents or something. Yeah, that's what it looks like. In this state support a microcosm of unique, possibly predatory life force. Detecting an artificial structure somewhere in the region. Oh. probably collect some of this cave bush and some of the, the violet bow am I not getting any of it there we go all right oh there's definitely something over here I think I may go grab the sea moth again though bring it down here a little bit closer Okay, hold on. I'm just gonna. There we go. 193. 
You just stay the hell away, eel. No! You bastard. Come here. No, won't let me attack it. That's not cool. Nice little jump scare there, though. Can't do anything with these. Uh, the, of course, everything's taking up massive space. Oh, didn't like that, huh? See, you bite me, I bite back. Oh, what's this over here? A regress shell. Well, we need to scan that. We already scanned red wart. All right, hold on. Because I'm not seeing any, any brain coral over here. All right, and it said artificial structure, but I'm not... Other than that one little platform... No, we're fine. We're fine. All right. I'm ready for you now, you. Is this an egg? Oh, gold. Oh, and I can't collect it. Are you kidding? That sucks. What's this over here? Nothing? It's nothing. Well, you know what? I'm just gonna self scan myself then. Self scan complete. Vital signs normal. Continuing to monitor. Well, the only like constructed thing I saw was that little platform and there was nothing there. Well, it's nothing I could do now. Yeah, that's why I always put my stuff away. Unless, of course, I know I'm going to be facing off against, you know, like eels or something like that. Not that I could probably take one out, but... At least I could make it think twice. All right, so the only thing I found was that one platform over there and it didn't actually offer me much. There is gold down here though. So that's cool. All right, so there's our pod. All 
Hello. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Whoops. There's something in there. Ah. Inventory full. Yeah, it is. All right, so do I need to use like the repair tool? Is that what I need to use? Yep, sure enough. No, wrong button. Let's get out of here. Repair tool. There we go. I guess we'll go ahead and convert all this. Yeah, it's definitely beat up. I rammed a stalker with it. Come on. Yeah, I definitely don't want to do that. Mmm, hoverfish. So, let's see. Uh, first aid kit, we're not worried about that. We've made all of this. We're not ever worried about that. Got the rebreather. The compass is the only thing that we're actually missing right now. Copper wire and a wiring kit. And the wiring kit, what are we missing on that? Silver ore. Hell, I may have some. That's salt. That's quartz. All right. Maybe I don't, but I have the copper. I can make copper wire. I can make copper. Yeah. We're good there. Then let's go see what we got outside. Lead. There's silver ore. Quartz, salt. 
gold. We do actually have gold. Let's put this titanium away for now. At least most of it. And I have nothing in this one. Wonderful. So, um, I guess we didn't figure out anything to do with the cave bush seeds or I guess, oh, they're seeds. So that's for like making like a flower bed or something. Like when we set up a base. Yeah, I don't actually own a switch. So, and I'm really not that much on the go. <laughs> But it is cool. I mean, it, it, for those that do have a switch and, and want that sort of thing, I think that that is fantastic. All right, so we can make copper wire. We need two silver ore. I only have one. That's not good. Ah, see, look, a computer chip that requires gold. I mean, I have gold, but I only have one gold. I'm sure we're going to need that at some point. All right. Um, our water's getting low again. So I suppose what I need is, because I have the salt, I need the coral tube samples. Are those still in here? No, that's table coral. I suppose it's not hard to go get them, so. There we go. We just need to grab our salt. Wasn't that one. I'm working on it. All right, Mark. Thank you for stopping by, buddy. Give my love to the girls. I do have some water in here. Vital signs stabilizing. Let's go ahead and eat that guy. But we're just gonna make some more water anyway because we need it. Thank you, Mark. Appreciate it. All right, now to make bleach. All right, we've made bleach. Now we can make water. There. Much. Oh, look at all of the wonderful water that we have here. We'll put that one away too. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that is absolutely the truth right there. All right. So tools. Yeah, laser cutter, we have to find diamond. It's probably not around here. It's probably not in the beginning area. Ah, so the habitat builder needs a computer chip. Good to know. Well, I'm sure you're just taking the seawater. I mean, bleach tablets are a, a legitimate thing, like in survival kits now.
Yeah, a little bit of bleach in your water is never a bad thing. A little bit. <laughs> So the Pathfinder tool deploys holographic Pathfinder disks used to make a way back out of caves or hard to navigate spaces. Maximum 20 disks, disks per path. That's cool. So I need some more grapevine seed clusters. How about a flashlight? Need a battery and glass. Fair enough. Well, I should have a crap ton of copper. Okay, maybe not a crap ton. I think I have more in here. I do. So I need to go get some more of the uh, little shrooms. So I can make a couple more batteries. Batteries. How many was that? Let's see, six, seven, eight. Yep, that's good. Oh, I need huh. like what? Ah, you'd think I'd be, I'd be used to it by now. Oh, we need glass. Okay. Well, I have glass around here somewhere too. There it is. If it were my game, there'd be like 10 floating chests under the pod body. <laughs> Flashlight. Yes. You're in school right now. Well, what are you doing watching uh, YouTube if you're in school right now? I could make another battery. I don't think I want to, though. I think I want to hold on to that copper for right now. It's not much, but still. Let's tuck those batteries away. And now we have a flashlight. Wow. We're, we are getting organized. But yeah, I definitely need to... Do I, should I? Okay. Now here's a legitimate question for any of you that have played. Do I need to hold on to this cave bush seeds and jelly shroom spores right now? Or can I just get rid of it? No. Okay. That's exactly what I'm going to do then. Look at how much more space I have. <laughs> Okay, so uh, we need to, what else can we get rid of? Oh, we have a few things we can get rid of. And we do have room to get rid of stuff. There, that's a whole lot better. And I suppose I don't need the radiation helmet right now. Because it's not like I'm going over to the ship. I'd much rather have the rebreather. Yeah, they just float back down to the bottom. Okay. Oh, yeah. See, they're there. Just kind of floating. Just my, my, my aquatic trash. So. We've hit all the markers. So the only beacons that I have... Let's change this to something that's going to stand out a little bit more. Yeah, not not in the life pod. That's right. Maybe we need to go over back over to life pod 17. Because it was near a cave system. So maybe we go check that out. But I'm not seeing the markers anymore. That's not cool. There it is. Welcome aboard, 
Good captain. Thank you. I just had to turn it off and turn it back on again and then it showed back up. Got that one? Yeah. Oh, there's the cave. Okay. This is the same cave system we were in? Or do they all just look similar like that? Warning. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. There we go. Oh. What is that over there? No. I think it's funny that we can swim deeper than the sea moth can go. Yeah, I can't break into the gold yet. Bastard. Come here. Actually, let's just do this. There. It only makes it worse. <laughs> what is going on, Lone Wolf? How you doing, buddy? Before I go exploring that, probably need to refresh my old air. Oh, look at this. Nice. here yeah that's where I want to go so 
Let's park this thing right here. Right at about 199 meters. There we go. Oh, there we go. 198. I'll take it. All right. Let's take a look. Um, Ah, uh, proposed Degasi habitat. Seven hundred meters away, so What's up, Pixie? And I probably don't have there's probably more gold, yeah. Ugh. Magnetite. I'm probably not gonna be able to collect anything down here, am I? I'm just gonna have to remember to come back over here. Finally found me a diamond. I just need one more. More gold. Nice. This was worth the trip right here. All right, let's um go catch our breath really quick. Diamond sword, huh? All right, so we explored down that hole. Is there another hole that we can explore down? Oh, what is this that we have here? Open the supply crate. Take the item. Absolutely. Can I scan any of this? No? God, these things suck. No, come on, get off me. That's why they just gave me that freaking health pack. Because they knew it was going to attack me. All right. So I don't think there's anything else that we can gather over here. Because we can't go inside. So I guess we're just gonna have to come back here later when we have better tools.
Warning. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. So I think this is one that we checked out before. Yep. Because there was nothing here that we could actually use. We can't swim down there, I don't imagine. I imagine that's very hot. But what am I doing? Hello, flashlight. That's pretty close, but I'm still not seeing anything that we can actually use, so. Got us a little piece of magnetite. that lithium all right 30 seconds huh Oxygen. we're good all right Yeah, I know. Easy. Ah, oh, shit. I'm stuck. No, nope, don't do it. Oh, I'm going to lose this thing, aren't I? Oh, no, I'm not. What the hell am I talking about? Get out. Oh, no. Say hello, Seamoth. <gasps> <laughs> Look at all this debris down here. I still don't have a laser cutter though. I probably won't be able to get in here without it. Yep. Yeah. Is this like the salt fields or something? Oh, it's quartz.
Oh, you gotta do what you gotta do. I really do need to make a laser cutter, but I think I needed the diamonds for it. How many diamonds did I get? One? One. I think I needed two. Alright, what is that? No, oh, we really don't have a lot in our inventory. What we could do is come up here and see if there's any barnacles on any one of these guys. There's one. All right. Um, yeah, I may have to eat the old bar. No, screw it. I'll just go catch a fish. We can eat raw fish, right? All right. I'm not seeing any more barnacles on this boy. Eat the acid mushrooms. Seek fluid intake. Yes, I know, I know, I know. He's got at least one on there. Is it just one? Knife and acid mushroom? All right. I can do that. Of course, now I can't find any, right? Oh, might as well pick this up while I'm here. Some more over here. See, I think I can eat fish raw. Yeah, plus eight food. I mean... It puts my water in a bad situation. I just need to go back and I got a crap ton of water. Seek fluid and take immediately. I know I'm working on it. All right, back to base. I'm working on it. Vital 
Vital signs stabilizing. There. Screw it. Vital signs stabilizing. There. All right, now I'm going to go knife and acid mushroom. You trying to kill me? <laughs> That's not cool, hun wolf. All right, somewhere around here. No, it's not over here. Let's see if I can remember where I saw it. All right, so there's, it's over here. Acid mushroom spores. They'll grow if planted in the right conditions. So that's my underwater flower bed, right? But for right now, I'm just going to go ahead and drop them. And speaking of dropping, let's drop a save. There we go. Yeah. Oops, get out of the box. Inventory full. A full is full. There's where I wanted to go, but I need more air. So, and I'm not seeing any, the brain coral. I'm going to have to go back up. 30 seconds. All right. 
Now let's go. We're just going to skip past him. Silver, okay. Nice. We've only got room for one more. We're going to skip the cords for now. Gold. Nice. The hell is our creature egg? I should just know. Whenever I go, what the hell is? It's always a creature egg. What the hell hit me? Don't know what it was, but it was not pleasant. All right, 45 seconds of air. We're gonna have to bolt out of here. And our inventory is full, so we might as well. This little thing is a freaking godsend, let me tell you. Inventory's full. <laughs> I really need to build the compass so that I can remember how to get back there. Can we make anything? Can we do anything? Now we can build a pump and pipes. A, what? You're having playback issues? That's not good. I'm not a, a whole lot of anywhere right now. Oh, I can make another wiring kit. What else do we need a wiring? We needed a wiring kit for something. We need to make laser cutter. So we need a battery, two diamonds, and again, we only have one, and some cave sulfur. Do we maybe have another bat or a diamond and I just forgot about it? That's quartz. Hmm. I'm just going to go ahead and use that one. There we go. So we're back up at a hundred. Let's see what we got outside. No diamond in there, but let's store some of this titanium. Shall we probably need to make more ingots and I have to break all this down too. All right, open that storage, more quartz, more titanium, prep ton of rubber or silicone rubber. Silver ore. Um, ch -ch -ch. all right. Let's go free up some more space, shall we?
We've got all of this stuff. We need copper wire. Excellent. Now we can make our compass. Oh, perfect. All right. So more copper wire. We're going to hold on to the copper, though, in case we need more batteries. Uh, deployables. Uh, we need to scan more grav traps, I guess. I need another. I have another battery. I already have the battery. Cave sulfur is easy enough to find. It's just that diamond. So we're going to have to go back to um, to where we were. Welcome aboard, Captain. Which is... I just come up here. All right, it's this way. We've already checked all this wreckage. Just gonna double check. I don't know what that is right there. Nothing. We don't need more salt right now. Lead. These? No, I don't think you can call those jellyfish. What are these? Nothing? Nope, nothing. More quartz. Crap ton of more quartz. Oh, there's another one, too. Huh, with, with my limited inventory, yes, I can. <laughs> oh, silver. Yeah, for right now... At least I just know where quartz is. <laughs> I need quartz? All right. Cool, I know where to get it. All right, time to head back over here. Is we're getting a little bit low on air. Is that copper? Yeah. Oh, yep. Oxygen. 
There we go. <laughs> All right. And actually, we can. We're not at, at a too bad of a depth. Too bad we can't pluck things. Oops. While we're in here. That's a shame. Alright, I'm not gonna keep using that thing. Because that requires a little bit more power. So you can't even interact with those fish. Alright, I... Well, I guess we'll just, we've got plenty of air right now. So we'll just keep swimming this way. That looks like another way out. Ow. All right. I think we've kind of yeah, that's nothing. Welcome back, Agent. I'll take the lead. We'll get the lead out. All right, so we'll head back this way. I guess this is the bottom? Oh no, no, yep. Hey, easy. Yeah, because that's the way we came in. Whoops. Sorry, don't mind the dents and dings. Oh, it's getting crazy. Ah, another one, really? It's taunting me. Yeah, I've got a decent amount of gold for still like just being right here in like the starting area. Spawn after a while. One minute you're building something big, the next minute you're having to scour the entire world for a piece of quartz. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's uh, that's typically how it goes, isn't it? That's a big salt deposit. Oh, scanner room fragment. Nice. Running out of uh, air. Why is it then whenever I really, really want to find one of those uh, stupid brain corals? I never can.
I mean, the Seamoth will work. Uh, yes. Well, they, they certainly try and eat me, that's for sure. All right, let's go park this more out here in the middle. Where we can get to it. What's our inventory look like? Oh, pretty much full. Awesome. <laughs> and this is going to fill it up right here. Still no diamond. The hell was that? Oh, it was that bastard right there. I don't know what the hell's attacking me. I really need to upgrade the Seamoth. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yep. Thank you. There it is. These are like the game's version of whales. You and your PVP. No, nothing at all. I have to deploy one of those soon again. Don't need a fire extinguisher. What can we make? Another wiring kit. That's not what I want to make, though. I want to make this. Still missing the damn diamond. Was that all I was able to do? Really? All right. Seek fluid intake. Yes, ma'am. Vital signs stabilizing. Is that better? You feel happy now? Let's go ahead and bring one of those with us. I hear you, True. I hear you. All right, that thing's, well, you know what? Let's, let's take this out as much as we can. We'll put all this lead away. We'll take the rest of that out and we're gonna convert it into ingots. That'll be a whole lot better. So let's put, um, let's put all this gold away in here. See, and look, I already have a cave sulfur. Man, I'm so close. So stinking close. I just need one more diamond. Let's get that out of there and put... I guess we'll put this lithium in there. There we go. Take all these out. Well, yeah, with your, your really expensive chair. Your freaking flight simulator chair. Oh, 
All right. So we've just converted, what, 20? <laughs> oh, look at that. That's just, that's just silly. All right. So we have a bunch of copper ore. I suppose we could just make up batteries. We can go get some mushrooms, make up some batteries. And then if we need to make the, the power cores for like the, uh, the seam off, we can do that. I thought you were going big or going home. What's the deal? You, you, you wussing out on me now, dude? <laughs> there, that should be enough. Soon, okay, soon. <laughs> We're gonna have batteries for days. I probably should make this. Oh no, that's silver ore. Yeah, I just want to get rid of this copper ore. We're gonna have a whole chest just full of batteries, just waiting to be used. And I'm okay with that. Now, what else do we use? So can I look in the little thing and it'll tell me, um, let's see, data bank. Um, we want, uh, ch -ch -ch. oh, what is this? Evidence suggests that a substantial number, if not all the local species reproduce through egg laying. Eggs can be found resting on the seafloor, buried underneath uh, detritus, or even wedged into cracks in the rock. Different species likely favor different biomes as their nesting grounds. Eggs discovered in the wild are in some form of natural stasis, likely awaiting ideal conditions to which hatch, or the delivery of some vital enzyme which will kickstart the process. It's impossible to calculate the species of the egg from the exterior. However, it may be possible to stimulate a hatching response if an egg is relocated to a suitable alien containment unit <gasps> jump jump dum. oh fine it's always something uh data downloads no no geological data um uh, maybe it's under exploitable no c I'm probably not going to get it, but Nope, 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 nope That's all right It would be nice if it told us See, that's something that I wish it had Like, uh, for instance If I come in here to the fabricator, right? And I come over here and it requires two silver ore for a wiring kit. It would be nice to know what else, what other blueprints that I know right now, not, I'm not saying every blueprint that's in the game, but everyone that I know, I wish there was a way for it to tell me quickly, if I pick silver ore, hey, you need silver ore for these blueprints. That would be nice. Yeah, it's definitely a great game setup. All right, so you know what? I'm gonna just make this stupid chip. Or wiring kit, whatever the hell it is. There, made a wiring kit. Now, let's grab these batteries. I guess I grabbed a little too much of the acid mushrooms there. Whoops. Let's store all this. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Let's put the silver ore away. Well, uh, hold, uh, get rid of the titanium, put that away. I need food. I need sustenance. Luckily, there's a lot to be had.
Oh, what was that? That one go. Not the boomerang, but... I'm just going to munch on them all. And then after I'm done munching on them. There we go. Now we'll drink that. We're going to drop all these. We don't need these right now. Every damn time. There. Look how clean my inventory is now. I'm telling you. Okay. Access upgrades. Oh, I can make upgrade modules. How do I do this? Is it a storage thing? Nope. Come back here. <laughs> How do I make upgrades? Maybe on the, the, the little dock thing here. Oh, I didn't want to pick it up. You bastard. Nope, that's... Little tip before going back to lurking, you can tag things you're needing to build in your HUD by going through blueprints. At least that's easier keeping track of something. Interesting. Okay. That's a fantastic tip. I guess I got to check the radio too. So if I come in here and uh, let's say over here. So how do I tag things? Or do I have to do it in here? Ah, uh, I have to do it in here, I'm sure. All right, so the laser cutter is what I want. How? All right, lefts and right clicks don't work. Apparently they've removed that from the game. Plasteel ingots. <coughs> wow. Yeah, it's not letting me like, I mean, it highlights what it, what I need in it, but it won't let me like do anything with it. That's unfortunate. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunday. Aurora, do you read? Over. Nothing but vacuum. These Altera ships, they run low on engine grease, they send an SOS, you offer to help, they don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take 
more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Oh, yes, yes, we do. Yes, I'll yes. Try them again tomorrow. Damn charters gonna have us blowing our credits, running errands for Altera. See what the long range things pick up in the meantime. Some key. Okay. So let's uh, come down again. Let's find what we, uh, our little laser cutter here. That's just me walking forward and backwards. E R. Can't imagine it would be anything. Maybe it's in the options. Jump PDA deconstruct deconstruct. Exit or holster. Left hand or use right hand. Cycle next. Cycle previous. The slots. Tool alternate use. Hmm. No, that is it. So some interesting. I well, I pressed E. I pressed F. Nope. Hell, I'll even press Q. Alt. Control, Shift, Caps Lock. <laughs> uh, ZXC. Just gonna... Keep tapping on yield keys. I have no idea. Seek fluid intake. Seek fluid intake. Vital signs stabilizing. There. That's better. And look at us. We're hurting. Not anymore. And now we have a new one. Okay. So I need diamonds. Diamonds are typically pretty low. Let's, um, what's this thing at, uh, 67%. Yeah. Let's go ahead and top that off. We'll get in. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Oh, that's funny. The compass goes there. Interesting. I haven't taken any photos. See, this thing's 250 meters down. It's not in the data bank or the voice log. Let's just have all those clear out. There we go. All right. Yeah, no pin icon in the corner of the blueprint or click on it once. I don't know how to click on it if I'm not in the PDA. I'll figure it out. I may have to just look it up. How do I pin crap? All right. So are we heading the right direction? Oh, you have to look for the Aurora. Yep. All right.
No, 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 it's all right. I appreciate it. Hey, I just fixed this thing. Do you mind? Rude. Tiger plant. Ow. It's shooting shit at me. That's not cool. Little bastard. Did I get it scanned? Apparently I did. All right, um, just gonna kind of cruise around over here. That's cool, the shadow of the Leviathan. <laughs> I know. Looks like we get more debris over here. Maybe some stuff that we can loot here, though. No? Modification station fragment. Definitely scanning that. Don't know what it does, but we want it. Hi, Mike. Welcome to the stream. Ah, oh, come on. To make me use a freaking health kit. There we go. Damn it. They're kicking my ass. And they are all over the place around here. Yeah, I know. Here, fishy, 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 fish. The fish is wherever I did go.
Don't eat the green ones. They're not ripe yet. See, I'm scared because I don't have any more health packs on me. But I really want to scan that. So let's see if there's any... And there's debris there. Uh, there's some tiger things there. We may be safe right here. I'm going to save just in case. <laughs> nice. Even better. All right, that worked out well. Hey, don't scratch the paint, dick. Inventories, we're not picking up any more salvage, that's for sure. But we might as well fill up on these little tiny rocks over here. Oops, wrong button. Grab this one. More of the same. Still no diamonds. That's all right. And now we're going to cruise on back to, well, home, I guess we could call it. Because, oh, I can't, can't look at my PDA and drive. That sucks. I guess no reading and driving, even in Subnautica. All right, first things first. Grab one of the, oh, can't grab one of those. Um. I guess we're fine. It's not like we're going to take more damage in here. I can't pick that up either. No, Mike, I just started playing the game. Oh, at least we can cook some hoop fish. I appreciate it, though. Thank you. All right, so that is uh, it for our inventory. Let's grab this now so that we can actually, we're gonna eat. And we'll use that. Isn't it said my inventory was just full a minute ago, but all that freaking titanium is now nicely compressed. Looks like I need to make more uh, Either catch some bladder fish or something along those lines. And we'll tuck that silver ore in there. Still looking for another diamond.
Um. We got a lot of batteries, though. Looks like it's time to make another little floaty box thing. Sinclair! Yeah, thanks for coming by. Yep, we've just been exploring. Uh, we're kind of reaching out a little bit, but... Uh... Got some gear made. Yeah, <laughs> it happens. I get it. So that <sighs> that's 250 meters down. I suppose we could get close. I just need to find where the entry point is. Radiation detected. Where the hell am I? Oh, didn't realize it was that close, actually. All right. This be it? I don't think so. Because the marker's that way. And well, we can't go that way. Ouch. Whoops. I suppose I should look where I'm going, huh? What the hell was that? All right, Mike, thanks for stopping in. Appreciate it. New creature discovered. Reginald. <laughs> what a great name for a fish. All right. So still trying to figure out how to get down to the proposed Degazi habitat. But um, I haven't found a way down yet. Oh, 
More rocks for us to pick up, though. I missed that piece. Ooh, catching some rads. Must be getting too close to the Aurora. Still catching rads. I don't see any bladder fish. They must not be in this area. Seek fluid intake. Yep. See, there it is. I'll stay away from that guy. So let's head back over to the life pod or towards the life pod. I'll keep our eyes open for bladder fish. Snag some peepers. Or anything that we can grab, really. All right, um, we'll just do this the old fashioned way then. There, inventory full. Seek fluid intake immediately. I know I'm working on it. bunch of water here all right the 
Vital signs stabilizing. There. And we're gonna like cook up all these fish. The Reginald looks good. It looks tasty, huh? I know, right? Just uh, and look at all this bleach I still have. It's crazy. And for each bleach that you can make two of these disinfected waters. That's microorganism free. So yeah, we're going to have a bunch of water here. So let's use the fabricator. We're going to cook us up some fish. I won't even need all this fish, but it'll probably all go bad. Well, not all of it. Well, basically, um, you were on a ship, as in spaceship, and it went down, and you crash landed, and this is your life pod, and you essentially crashed on an ocean planet. And um, you're trying to survive, and uh, there's a lot, uh, you get like radio transmissions from other life pods, but when you get there, there's nobody there. Oh, we're out of power. That's why. That's why it was shutting down. That's fine. Uh, so, yeah. And um, as you find new things, like find titanium or lead or copper, uh, you unlock new blueprints. So that, you know, this is all your cooking stuff and, you know, O2 tanks and fins and radiation suits. And you just build all this stuff. It's, yes, it's a survival base building game. <laughs> That's... Uh, which is what caught my interest in it. I was like, hey, that's kind of different. Ooh, a thermo blade. I need a battery and a survival knife. Well, I happen to have both of those things. So we, uh, let's finish eating our fish first, I suppose. Oh yeah, 128. Oh, perfect. Are you ready yet? You are. Go ahead and use that. Ah, it's so nice to see all of our stuff back up all full and everything. So, and we have some more coral tube samples, which means that when we grab salt, which I know I have somewhere, uh, we can make even more water. So that's fantastic. This can go away. We can take that out. Um, let's see. Let's grab, no, no. What do we want to stow? Oh, we can tear that one down. Uh, just wire. Yeah, and I have um, I have Game Pass Ultimate for Xbox, which means that I get all the PC games as well. And this is actually, it was on Game Pass, so. I didn't even have to pay for it. That's the best part. So let's go ahead and take these uh, table coral samples out. And we'll put some of these waters away. And um, let's go ahead and take all of this out if we can. All right, so not quite. 610, we can make another ingot, but I want to actually make another one of these. Hell, I may make two of them. Are we out of power again? Yeah, it's unpowered. Power four of 75. did was give me coordinates for dry land we regroup one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site stay together and good luck this message will now repeat rendezvous coordinates corrupted transmission origin coordinates downloaded signal location uploaded to pda cool 
Dry land, huh? That's exciting. Can I make one more? Yes. All right. Now let's get out of here. We're gonna do a little swim. I would drop that one, drop that one. <laughs> all right, uh, so let's uh, put all this away. There we go. And then in this one, let's put all this. I'm just going to drop that. Wow. The peeper actually gives me plus H2O. Huh. Too bad it's old protein rich eyeballs. Highly nutritious. <laughs> oh, wonderful. All right. Um, so there's my battery. And I need to... No, it doesn't sound very yummy at all, does it? Tools... Well, where's the thermal blade? I have everything I need. I have the knife. I have the battery. Let's take check out a thermal blade. Right, I have everything. Oh, I need to build a modification station. That's what it is. Now, where do I... Um, let's see here. Yep. So this, I imagine I probably have to build in a base, which I don't have. So, yeah, because wall locker, yeah, interior module. So, okay, I can't modify it until I set up a base. Fair enough. Come on, open, open. Thank you. Let's put the battery back away. We're going to go ahead and take these acid mushrooms out of here. Because now we're just going to drop them. No need in having something like that, you know. See, now look, the, the peepers minus one H2O. It's kind of weird. All right. So. That's life by 930 meters away. Let's go get in the sea moth. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you should be over here 300 meters down Ooh. we're at 50 percent power so we have to be mindful of that Whoa, it is just black. All right, and we are reaching almost. Yeah, there's there it is. Okay, so maybe we have to dive down there. Ugh. All right, here we go. Two minutes. Start the clock. Here, let's get there a little bit faster, shall we? 
Whoa. Oh. Those damn spitting things. The hell is that? A gel sack? That's disgusting. Damn tiger things. If I can kill them, I should try it. Oh, I did. Nice. That works out well. I mean, I got hit a bit, but... What can we do with these eye stalks, huh? No, not gonna give me nothing? All right. It is time. Let's swim back up. Refresh our air. All right, air is refreshed. Out we go again. Inventory full. Oh, shit. Yeah, we don't need those right now. Let's just get rid of that. Oh. So glad I picked that up, huh? How big are those things? Oh, good. They're small. All right. Time to go get more air. And back down we go again. <laughs> jewelry store around here sure we're gonna need those for some huh come on just one more diamond Probably can't break this, yeah.
I don't know if I have enough time to be doing this, but... We're out of here. Let's go. So let's take a look at what we got here. We unlocked a couple new blueprints. What did we unlock? Ultra high capacity tank. Oh, hell yes. And I think I already have the lithium. I have two and I think I have two more. So we definitely need that. And what's the other one that we unlocked? Aero gel, light porous dried gel. High heat insulation. And look, it needs gel sacks and rubies. Well, I happen to pick up both of those things. So I don't know what we can use the aerogel for. I mean, it's advanced materials. Maybe it's for... Well, that's not good. All right. What's our inventory look like? Uh, I think... Let's go ahead and get our inventory full. I'd hate to be all the way out here and... Go home with em or, yeah, empty spots. That's not good. So we'll pick up some more of the... Oh, look, more rock. Yes. Still looking for that diamond in the rough. What do we got here? Nothing? All right. Nothing in there. What is this? Prawn suit torpedo arm fragment. Scan that. Thank you very much. All right. What's this up here? Oh, that's just table coral. Nice. Power cell charger. Means we can charge our batteries. Oh, score on the lithium. Inventory full. Silver ore. Um, we can drop the salt deposit. I'd much rather have... Uh, I always do that. Back here. What the hell is that? Come on, hurry, scan. Oh, I definitely need to come back down here, even though I have no room in my inventory. I know, I know. Thank you. And out we go again, because I definitely want to go check out what else is down here with that whole alien vent thing. Uh, my flashlight battery is at 30%. That's weird. Huh. That's just an egg. Die, you stupid plant. Now I'm almost dead. 
I guess it's time to go home. <laughs> Our poor little ship's all like limping. It's down to 48. That's home, right? Why does it feel like it's underwater? Go ahead and fix this first. There we go. All right, so in the fabricator, look at this advanced materials. That's a whole new button right there. Make another wiring kit. So, what else did we pick up here? Oh, we we need that other lithium. Do I have it in here. No, that's silver. I guess we can tuck those in there. There we go. All right, um, let's put, um, I want to hold on to a couple of these rubies in case we need them for anything else. We'll put that gold in there. see here oh damn it I need a modification station maybe I need to just set up a small habitat like right here just so I can get some of this stuff done I imagine you could have more than one base huh so I need to make the the habitat tool the habitat builder a computer chip wiring kit and a battery
Did I use all the wiring kits that I made? I thought I made like two of them. I know I used one. Apparently I did. Okay, so we need a chip. Right, we need a computer chip, a wiring kit, and a battery. Battery we have, so I'm not worried about that. So let's see, computer chip, what do we need? Table coral, gold, copper wire, and silver ore. Fair enough. Now that's all gold. That's more lithium. Take the copper. Take the battery, copper wire, and we needed the table coral samples, I think. Can you tell I'm a hoarder? All right. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Uh, we'll take the silver. Um, we'll take the copper just because I know that we're going to need it for like copper wire and stuff. All right, now let's see what we can make. Oh, another flashlight. I I don't know if you can swap out the batteries in the flashlight. I don't know. All right, so we can make the computer chip right now. So let's make that. And then we also need a wiring kit. So we need silver ore times two, and we only have times one, but that's all right. We have one right there. Wiring kit. Now we should be able to come down here to tools, the habitat builder. And we're just going to drop it right underneath us. <laughs> My first base is going to be really, really close. Um, so let's go see how that works, shall we? Yeah, I think we just put it like right down here. I'm just looking for a place where we can set up some of that other, the other tools, like the modification bay and stuff like that. So let's... um. Let's see, there's the habitat builder. We'll go ahead and put it right here for now. Um, set on five. There we go. Five. All right, so what can we build? Nothing right now. <laughs> Multi purpose room, scanner room, hatch, glass tube, reinforcement. First, we need titanium and lead. Titanium. That's just for a foundation. How does this work? All right. It's kind of awkward. Let's go grab some titanium. Let's. Oh, uh, shit, I don't know. <laughs> We're just making this shit up as we go along anyway, right? We need lead, so let's go ahead and grab that. Uh, let's put this copper away for now. Grab more lead. Put away more copper. Oh no. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. Um, uh, man, do I not have any regular titanium? Did I convert it? Oh, there's two. That's a, uh, that's a good start. Let's come down here. Oxygen. All right. All 
All right, construct. Building our first foundation. So does it like, oh yeah, look at that. Wow, and it sunk all the way down. That's awesome. All right, uh, so five. Oh no, not deconstruct. There we go. Plus two to hull strength, total now 12. And I think you have to stay at like 10 or above. So, um, let's see, let's uh, grab, um, yeah, we can't build those yet, but we can do an eye compartment. Okay. Needs two titanium. So let's just set up something. Let's do that. Uh, let's do a hatch. No, can't put a hatch there. No, no hatch. Fair enough. Um, we could do a 90. Like that. Okay. Put in a T compartment. Oh, let's do it that way. And, um, what else do we have up here? Exterior modules. Ah, solar panel. Nice. Powers, habitat, oxygen generation, other habitat modules converts while available sunlight into low power electrical energy. Nice. Okay. Interior spaces. We have a bioreactor composed organic matter into electrical energy. Then we also have a ladder to connect to floors, interior modules. These are all the different things that we can build inside. And miscellaneous gives me a sign. Hmm. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Base attached air pump pumps oxygen from a powered habitat to an attached pipe network. So can we snap a... So we don't have to stay on the foundation, I guess. So we went with another little L-shaped one here, like that. And then we could fit a little eye in there, like that. All right, that's cool. Now we just need a crap ton of titanium. But I still don't know where to put a hatch. How in the hell do we get in? Yeah, it provides an access point. Where does this go? Maybe it doesn't go anywhere. Maybe there's something that I'm missing. I can't build it because... Because I'm missing something else. Maybe like this multi-purpose room. Vertical connector. Oxygen. So where does the hatch go? Shit, I don't know. It's kind of weird. It doesn't rotate around at all. Yeah, tried that. Maybe I need... No, because it won't let me go down with the L. I bet you I need, like, the multi-purpose room. Now, where, where 
would this go? Yeah, see, there's no place to connect this either. For the vertical. All right, so let's just go grab some titanium. See, I wonder if it'll break these down. Guess we'll find out, huh? Let's put this arrow gel away and we'll grab some more of the ingots. All right, uh, took that away, put that away. All right, dun, 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 dun. Is this gonna work? Nope. Ah, oh, so I made all these ingots, now I can't use them? That sucks. And it won't let me swim. That's funny. It's like stopping me, <laughs> even though it's just like a little blueprint thing. Hmm. Okay. So. Maybe in here. Let's no, let's not deconstruct it. And that's like the hammer. It wants me to demolish everything. Ultra strong synthetic construction material. I don't need plasteel. Well, that's not good. That sucks. Hmm. All right, let's um, put, just fill that out. And uh, I'm just gonna go find some there. More copper. I mean, I won't complain about copper, but. There we go. That's one piece. That was lead. What is that? A beacon fragment. We need to scan that. Can we scan anything else around here? Come on, my name's Scanny Scammerson. A counter. I bet that's important. Yep, it sure was. Come here, peeper. Oh, that was fortuitous. I love these things. I want one all the time. I'm just going to sit here and let them refill my air. We're getting there. Take a little drink. There we go. Just a dead fish.
You still having issues? Come on, stalker. You want some of this? Bring it. Oh, that's going to give us a lot of titanium right there. Any other salvage around? No. Like a nice dark hole. I don't remember if I went down in that or not. Picking up this salt so that we can, uh, anything in there? No. So we can make some more water. So let's get some air and then we'll grab the old tool here. Oh no, apparently I didn't have enough. Nope. Didn't have enough titanium. <laughs> That's all right. We'll get a bunch of it right here. Saying get out of here, stalker doesn't work mainly because this isn't stalker nor. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Hey, we have our first piece. First two pieces. All right, so now, where is it? There it is. I still don't know where, oh, oh, look at that. Oh, very cool. Let's enter our base. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. <laughs> so cool. Struct. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. We're still losing air, but that's all right. So we can put a counter. Where can we put the counter? Can we put it here? No. Spin the other way? That'd be kind of weird. That's weird that it won't go back in that, that nook. Gotta watch my air. Yeah, I know. I don't have a bigger room though. I got what I got right now. 
Because, and, and the reason I say that is because I can't make um, I can't make the multi-purpose room yet or the scanner room yet. So I've just been putting like little tube pieces together. <laughs> Gonna need a bigger boat. All right, so, oh, get some air. Basically what I'm trying to do, Lone Wolf, is I'm actually trying to make like the modification station, another fabricator, the radio, wall locker. That would be fantastic to make a wall locker. Or you got this locker locker. Large freestanding storage. Oh, that's a small one. That's a large one. Okay. And a power cell charger so that I can charge my batteries. So, yeah, that's a, basically, I mean, I literally am building this thing right underneath the life pod. So. I'm not doing some big extravagant thing. It's just my first one. But I converted all of my freaking titanium to ingots and it won't convert it back. So I got a bunch more copper, got some salts. Oh, did I leave those downstairs? <laughs> downstairs, he says. Yep, there they are. I'm working on that. Oh, no, I need to make bleach first. I don't know why I have a bunch of bleach, don't I? Or did I use it all? I don't remember. But I'm just going to make more anyway. Whoops. There. Scanner room is actually easy to find. They're littered all over red grass. Well, oh, the bigger room, you can find that yourself. I need to do some researching since again, it's been a while. Fair enough. All right, let's uh, consume some water. That's rotten. We're not going to eat that. There. So we'll go dump that out in the, <laughs> in the ocean. It's the circle of life, baby. Yeah, look at all this extra water we already had. That's all right though. So I got to go over to the red grass. Okay. Yeah, I have a crap ton of titanium ingots. So now I have to go looking for titanium just to build anything because I was too efficient all right drop that do not eat it let's go grab a fish to eat oh it's a Gary fish look it's a loco four pack fish can I eat the Gary fish plus four food minus three water well, that's not a small edible prey fish. No. What was that good one? It was the, um, the peeper. Yeah. Come here, peeper. All right, let's go make some dinner really quick. Oh, 
Oh, I might as well cook the Gary fish. Wow, he's huge. I thank you, computer voice. Yeah, skin room's a bit common around wrecks like the Seamoth wreck. All right, cool. All right, let's. Uh, oh, yeah, plus 32 food. Hell yeah. Cooked peeper, the way to go. And the, this Gary fish, fresh, gives you plus to your water intake as well. So I might as well just eat it, you know. All right, so I need to go. To the red grass. Oh, it's still dark outside. Oh, here comes the sun. I want to scan one of those birds. Or bird things. All right. Might as well grab the moth. Welcome aboard, Captain. See, I think we've we've I've checked everything here. We can't do any of that. The birds? You can ride the birds? Oh, here we go. Maybe there's something around here we can scan, huh? Nope, can't scan anything there. Of course, because that would just be too cool. All right, let's uh, get some altitude here. See if there's anything else we can find. Got some more wreckage over here. Is there any wreckage down in here? I don't know. Maybe we should go down and find out, huh? Yeah, see, I've already been down here before. But I'll come check it out again. These stupid eels that live inside the mushroom things. Hey, 
Yeah, see, these are all just cargo boxes. There's nothing to scan here. Yeah, we've been down here before. Leviathan are just awesome. Now, speaking of Leviathan, let's go see if this one has any barnacles to pick. You got anything I can collect off you? Not seeing any. Apparently, I've already picked this one clean. All right, so. I'm not seeing that's a big debris field, but we've checked all that stuff. We've checked that. Or did we check that? Yeah, we did. I got gotcha. you. It's uh, quite the, uh, the field down here. Let's see. That's salt. Oh, moon pool. Thermal plant. Oh, yeah, we're getting a bunch of stuff over here. Thank you for that, level. Just killing it over here.
All right, let's grab some air. Uh, there's a lot of things that you can't build. Uh, so if you want like the, the really good, uh, for example, I'm glad you asked that. Let's talk about that for a second. Um, well, look at that. We can make an advanced wiring kit now. If we come down here, like the thermo blade, the ultra high capacity tank, you have to build that in a modification station. And the only way to build that, uh, the modification station is to actually go, it goes in a base. So if I scroll down here, you can see modification station. So it's an interior module for the base. And you can also get a large locker that's freestanding, a power cell charger to recharge your batteries. So yeah, there's a lot of things that you would really want a base for. And again, I'm just setting up a very basic base right now so that, um, so that I can hook up like this modification station. Yeah. So in our room, <laughs> well, why not? It has a radio. I mean, floodlights, solar panels. Vehicle docking bay with high energy and structural requirements. A standard payload delivery system adapted to fire torpedoes. <laughs> cool. Yeah, see, I want the ultra high capacity tank in the thermoblade. Cooks and sterilizes small organisms for immediate consumption. Well, and I'm probably drowning too. Oh, did I? Oh, hold on. Let me get out of here. I had actually just gone back to the, the ship to, uh, to recharge. No, that's a salt deposit. That's the desk. I got that because that's just your, uh, your radio. You won't even let me scan it. Nothing. So what did I miss? This one? Nope. Go to your Seamoth instead of entering and turn around and look to the right a bit. Okay. So I'm at my Seamoth. I'm going to spin around. Oh, nice. Oh, thank you very much, Lone Wolf. All right, now I need more air. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right, that's awesome. All right, so I am going to pause this really quick, guys. I've been sitting in this chair for four and a half hours with no break because I've been so enamored with this game, but I really have to take a quick bio break. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> give me just a second here. I will, uh, queue up whatever video I have in my B right back screen. So, uh, yeah, give me just a second and I will be right back.
What is going on, survivors? Draco Invictus here with a new series. I'm running a bunch of different stuff on, on Night of the Dead. I'm just having so much fun with this game. And um, this series is going to be devoted not to Lucy, but to the base. Can we build a base to withstand the hordes night after night after night? So there is not going to be any journal getting. This will never advance the storyline. This is just about, can we build the base? And then when we're done with this one, however far we can push it, then we'll do it again, but in a different location, different design. We'll try different things. And, and of course the base is gonna modify and stuff like that, but we're gonna have some fun with it. So as you can see, we are zero day, 22 hours, I got a fantastic spawn when I started this game. And for those of you that don't know, the spawn is random. You can spawn to several different places on the map. Let's uh, take a look at the map. I actually spawned right up here at about, uh, what was it? 9.2 by 18.8, .8, something like that. So right up there. So I just came down the road and here I am. Here is my day zero going into day one base. I mean, right now it's very simple. Just got a couple benches up. I've got my little trap line here with a shredder. The shredders are fantastic. You guys will see here in just a second. But I also have this great flat area. So I'm going to be able to build lots of stuff. Very quick access to trees and other materials. And why is this such a great spawn? Hold on. Yeah, it's it's actually back over there. The hospital's right there. For those of you that don't know the importance of the hospital, the hospital is incredible. First off, you can get a lot of um, weapons, different weapons in there. If you're playing single player, there's different outfits that you can pick up in there, shirts and stuff like that. And you will get a read ridiculous amount of research material. I mean, when I say ridiculous amount, I'm saying 800 to 1,000 research material in that building alone. It has like five floors, clear the whole thing out, you'll be swimming in research material. So for an early game character, a day zero character, swimming is absolutely right. The hospital is still the best place to get research material. Police department's a very close second. All right, guys, I am back and uh, let's go ahead and drop a save here and uh, turn that down just a hair. Before bases, huh? Wow. All right. So we've got a bunch of stuff over here, uh, but we did not get the. Um, the multi-purpose room, that's why we're still missing that. We did get the moon pool, but uh, we're missing the multi-purpose room. We got to find two of them. So I guess we're going to stay on the hunt for for more debris fields, but we may need to wait until it's like morning time. Because trying to see this crap with nothing but the light on the Seamoth is kind of difficult. Warning. Maximum depth Oops. Whoa, whoa. Wow. I was way low. Can we swim in there? I wonder where that takes us. I wonder if it takes us anywhere. Let's find out. Nope. Nope. Oh, oh, please tell me I got it. Where's my light? No, I didn't. Fuck. 
Finally, I can make the laser cutter. Alright, let's head back to base then. If I can make the laser cutter. That's worth making the trip back. No, not really true. It it, it seems that the I mean I guess I'm I mean the world's a pretty big place and I'm kind of like still in the beginning area, I'm assuming. Because I haven't gone more than five or six hundred meters from um, from my base. Oh, look, barnacles. Let's go get those while we're at it, right? The hell's attacking me? Oh, the stupid tiger things. I was playing a, a game of dodge with those little bastards. There's another one over here. Two of them. Yeah, I kind of figured that. All right. Yeah, see my battery is down to 29% on this thing. So being able to set up a, a charging station, I know I'm going to have to make another one, but at least while one's being discharged, the other one's being charged. I don't know. Mark Jackson was saying something about that earlier. All right. I forget what else I need. So we'll just come in here and. Um, laser cutter. I need a battery and cave sulfur and the other diamond, of course. Um, do, do, do. Let's be, all be outside. This doesn't surprise me at all. Does it surprise you? I mean, I'm going to surround the lifeboat with storage. <laughs> quartz. Quartz. No, 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 no. Not what I'm looking for. Oh, wait. That had the sulfur. There it is. No, uh, there it is. Take it. Yes, stalkers. Oh, battery. Damn it. It's not one thing, it's another. No, those are outside. They're in the last chest over here. There they are. Finally. Now I have to like revisit most of the wrecks that I've already been to. Gotten here. All right, so I'm going to swap this out for the repair tool for now. Look at this. I have more titanium, which means that I can 
go do another little piece of my my crappy little building over here. See, there we go. I thought I had one more. No, I guess not. Yes, the grav trap. I've I've been scanning those things. All right. Oh, easy. Let's put that away for now. I don't know if they're serving a purpose, but uh, they're still in the game. I can scan them at least. Keepers, good eats for the win. I think Alton Brown would even like them. So, yeah, I don't understand what we're supposed to be doing with the stalkers. I know that they like the uh, the metal fragments. But I don't know what that gives me. Ooh, what's that over there? Make them ram the metal. Okay. Yeah, see? Grav trap fragment. Make one and release the grav trap in a decently populated area of fish. All right. I can do that. Ha! You missed me, you bastard. Now I'm going to take your sulfur. Two of them? That's not cool. There it is. <laughs> let's come into our inventory and uh, let's put this back on five please <laughs> Ah, 
God damn it, he got to me. Damn it. Oh no, not the titanium. See, look, that little bastard's laughing at me. Did you hear that? That's an egg. Did I raid the blown up ship yet? No. I just got a laser cutter. I'm going to hold off on the rest of that. This is what I need there. I need a wiring kit, two gold, and a computer chip. Wow. But I have nothing calling for that yet. So I can make a beacon now. Navigational aid maintains and broadcasts its position. Configurable a name. So, yeah, beacons would be cool. Let's make a beacon. And I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that you can pick them up, right? Can you pick up a beacon once you put it down? All right. Yeah. So when you find a good, you know, spot to farm some resources or whatever, but you run out of inventory, you could drop that beacon down, mark it and, and just name it like, you know, come here or something like that. All right. Oh, that's awesome. There, nice and full. Use that. Grab a new one out of here. Do, do, do. Let's put that on four. Well, let me get back up to the service and we'll, we'll see what it needs. Look at all the upgrades I can do now. That's cool. Storage module. Definitely doing that. <laughs> but I'm guessing, where do you make these? Do you make them? Oh, hold on. Let's look up the, uh, the grav trap first. There it is. Oh, I just need a battery. I have everything else and I have the battery too. So do I do upgrades in here? No. Oh, the moon pool. So I need the moon pool. Okay. That's cool. Batteries. Take that. Did I get a battery? Yes, I did. All right.
There it is. All right, have a grav trap. So go find a large group of fish. So I'll just, I suppose I probably should put it like, um, I'll put it uh, there. Not like these fish. You're not talking about like little babies. You're talking about like fish fish. Like how, um... Try here, like here, okay? There's not many fish around here. We come up here and get some air. Ah, uh, here we go. Wow, actually more fish than I ever. <laughs> oh, inventory full. Yep. Yeah, it is. But I can't pick it back up because my inventory is full. That is fantastic. Wow. <laughs> yes, that is. I haven't made a beacon yet. Did I make a beacon? No, I didn't make a beacon yet. Oh, yeah, I did right there. Edit beacon name. Let's see, food. Oops. Food. Oops. There, grab some air. That is awesome. So now I just need to build like a solar panel. Well, I need to obviously build a, something a little bit more onto this, but it's at least a good start. Wow. 
And will it grab like if new fish like swim to it or, or does it not work like that? I wouldn't doubt if it didn't work like that, but I don't know why I'm cooking all this food. I'm totally full. But I guess even the food will help with my my water at this point. Because they each give me plus five. And that's better than drinking water, huh? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's... That's handy like shirts on or like pockets on a shirt or something right there. All right. Um so the next thing I need to take a look at is solar panels. I need two quartz. Actually, I just need one more quartz. And I can make a solar panel. No, that's silver. Quartz is outside, apparently. Use salt to cure the cooked food. No, not in there. Whoops. Whoa. There we go. No, oh, I already had a four. So do I have to hook it up to anything? Warning, emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. Well, at least it, uh, there's no water in here. <laughs> Right, just gotta wait for daytime. I know that's not a good place to put it, but it'll work for now. So where is it? All right, so this will fit back in these cubbies though. Or not. Oxygen. Oh, crap. I'm going to die down here. Whew. All right, this is very cool. Grab some to drink here really quick. Power restored. All primary systems online. <laughs> oh, let's go check it out. Welcome aboard, Captain. Ah, oh, look at that. We don't need like gas tanks or anything. I know I, this is not a very good design, but it is what it is at this point. This goes on the ground. Guess so. We put it along this wall so we could get past it. Oh, I suppose so. Hey, 
Yeah, it's very basic and simple, but it, and damn it if it doesn't work. And then a locker. Need quartz and two titanium. This needs a computer chip, titanium, diamond, and lead. That's gonna suck. Diamond, ugh. Um, and then the power cell charger. Oh, that mounts on a wall, okay. Yeah, we're just gonna kind of cram everything back here in this area. Oh, I'm so glad I saved those rubies. Oh, that's wonderful. Yeah, it's my silly little base that I can add on to. Question is, where did I put the rubies? There they are. And I also need a titanium, which I have two titanium. Oh, look at that. It put support structures underneath all this stuff. That's cool. Oh, I need an advanced wiring kit. Totally didn't see that. Yes, we are actually. But what I need to do right now is because this battery is at 27%. So I need to um, probably make another power cell before we go looking for more wreckages. I would just hate to be stranded, so. And what do I need? I need rubber and batter, two batteries. Got that. And then where's my rubber at? There we go. Oh, and I have another radio call. No. Oh, it's up here. Duh. There it is. Power cell. Oh, that's cool. That's great to know. Let me grab this radio really quick. Is that uh, previous next there we go there nice Welcome aboard, Captain. all right so wreckages I have a laser cutter now. Can we cut into these? Some of these? Yeah, there's a door right there. So let's put that on slot three. I know we don't need it, need it, but it'll give us titanium, so I'll take that. Is there maybe another way into this wreckage? Nope, I guess not.
All right, so let's move on. The event or a big hole. Okay, so maybe I just need to keep looking. Aha! Oh, this one I could just open. Didn't even need to cut it. Guess that's everything in here. Oh. No, I can use my repair tool. But first I need to get some more air. And uh, let's see, repair tool. There it is. Let's put that on four because I don't need the habitat builder right now. That was if I grabbed the right one. There we go. Carry a full spare tank with you and quick swap. Oh, okay. Nice. So I could make it like a, another, another tank. That's cool. All right. So I guess we're done in here. This helps. Double check, make sure I didn't miss anything. Nope, looks like we got, oh, what's this? Look. Inventory full, shit. Yep, that would be, oh, hold on. We need some water anyway. There. Oh yeah, absolutely. Oxygen. I know. Crate had something also vent. Ah, the swivel chair. Gotta get that. Can't forget the swivel chair. Can I like cut this? No.
All right, we're, we're full anyway. Yeah, I, and I don't know that I have much room in here. Nope, not much room at all. And I don't need this power cell right now. Yeah, all right. Oh, no. Ah, damn it. There. Lunch where, whenever I want it, right outside the door. All right. <laughs> Okay, good to know. Uh-oh. Oh, I didn't bring it with me. I'm still wearing my rebreather. No, no. Oh, damn it. All right. That's some dead peepers right there.
<laughs> I just have a pretty good repair tool. We didn't need that fish anyway, right? It's not in here, it's outside. What was I thinking? All right, let's grab the radio. This is life pod six. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. I don't know, am I? I'm thinking I should make another freaking storage box. Tired of running out of storage all the damn time. I knew what you meant. All right, so I'm going to hold on to... There we go. And we did that one. I think we did this one, didn't we? I don't remember. Shit. I pray mod. Okay. Uh, not much right now. Life pod six, right? So I'm not seeing that anywhere in the data bank. Maybe in here. Been received from life pod six, but attached coordinates were corrupted. Last available photographic data has been downloaded and analyzed. Sunk to approximately 100 meters, located in an area dense with red grass near a number of natural arches and rock stacks. Transmission origin, approximately 400 meters west northwest of Life Pod 4's last known location. Got it. right underneath my life pod right now and it's not even complete
Well, I don't know where Life Pod 4 was. We haven't seen Life Pod 4 yet. Because we're not 4, we're 5, right? Yeah, we're 5. Yeah, there's my little base right there. All right, so we can't do that one yet. Because I have no idea where 4 was. Or is. So I guess we'll continue just looking for debris. Oh yeah, I know. Yeah. See, but we can come back over to this because we should be able to find a way in now. There. Go away, stupid fish. Seconds. Ah, crap. All right. You just wait till I put guns on this, some bitch. Command chair. Yeah, we were just talking about that just a few minutes ago. Really? We just come in here the whole time? out or is that another oh, my flashlight's about to die Oh, nice. Even better. Thirty seconds. All right, I guess I better hurry then.
Aw, how sweet. Yep. Time to go. All right, we got another radio signal. All right, sounds good. Oh, vending machine. Definitely want that. Gotta have Doritos underwater, right? Inventory full. seconds all right um check this box and we'll Oxygen. come on thank you and inventory is full Time to head back home. The hell did I hit that time? crazy speaking of fish i think i need to grab something to eat oh i can't inventory is full <laughs> damn it that's all right we'll come up here take care of that it's a shame you can't break down ingots back into regular just titanium And we're full. Guess we need to drink some water anyway. All right. So under. Yeah, what do we need for that? Welcome aboard, Captain. Um, let's just put it. 
put it there for now. Now I need quartz. That's just ridiculous right there. <laughs> wow, that's some fantastic storage. All right. What does this mean? Advanced wiring. Uh, that's what I need to make is an advanced wiring kit because I have the Ruby. I have the titanium. I just need the advanced wiring kit. And then I can start charging the freaking battery. Oh, I'm not carrying it with me right now. Come here, you little bastard. And this is like going to a freaking smorgasbord right there. It's like a buffet. Oops. Oh, check the radio. salt on me oh i'm not gonna cook the bladder fish though yeah we're not doing that all right Hmm. Love hearing myself crunch. Might as well grab that and throw that. Yes, I can. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because we can bring all this down there now. There we go. Oh, titanium. It won't put any of it in. That's not cool. Yeah. Well, at least they're down here now. So we don't have to keep running back and forth. I mean, and, um, deconstruct and reconstruct. Fair enough. Let me grab this back then. Grab those, grab those.
Negative Ghost Rider. Oh, no. No, his power's at 70%. Yeah, it let me um, partially construct one of these pieces because I had like half the titanium I needed. Yeah, now I'm just wasting power in my little building tool. Wow, that thing's pretty far away. Guess we can go over there, though. That's something to do. I probably should fix this, huh? 54. possibly drown fair enough no because it's only 250 meters under i can get to pretty much 200 so i only have to swim the last 50 meters that's of course i can't get down there with the sea mob. the furthest I've been from home. Well, this is a very interesting thing. Area is dominated by plant life. Picking up faint or terror vehicle warning. Signature. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I thought I was under. Apparently, there we go. Yeah, as soon as I get out, I'm going to have to fix this thing. Looks like we're swimming from here. Passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. Detecting volcanic activity and several unusual electromagnetic signatures in the region. Exercise caution when diving deeper. Knife one of the bulbs? You want me to take out one of my headlights? <laughs> Is 
Is that save on power? Is that what that, that, that whole deal is? Let's put this back on one. We got the scanner. We're going to put this back on five. Put the flashlight on four for what it, good it's going to do. Oh, wrong button. You're talking about one of those down there? All right, let me get my air back. Ah. Passing 200 meters, oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Uh, six one half a dozen of another. Oh shit. Come here. <laughs> Hit the right button. There we go. There. Old bulb bush sample. I better eat it, huh? Yes, you're going bad on me. the hell hit me but all right so this is beacon 12 sunk to the uh, we can turn that off oh see didn't know that well now i want to go down there and get some more maybe over here Now, I don't know what the hell that is, but I want nothing to do with it. Warning. Maximum depth range. There it is. Damage imminent. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. All right, so I got two of them. Ah, damn it. Not what I wanted to do. <laughs> All right, so I got two of them. <laughs> oh, don't mind me, guys. It's on eleven twenty-four. I've been up since six fifteen this morning. So. All right. Um. Hi, Brandy Torres. Okay. So, and I'd love to explore this some more, but all right, where do we get it? You tell me where to go. Go 
Go above the water to see if we're close to one. Okay. Screw this. I'm going to say no. You don't know what to do. All right. Well, what are we, what are you trying to do, Randy? I don't know what to do either. I just started playing this game about six hours ago. Well, actually I have about seven hours in it total, but, uh, but yeah. So I'm just been kind of exploring and my buddy here, Lone Wolf, has been uh, kind enough to to gently guide me along without saying, OK, hey, dumbass, go do this, you know. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm not seeing an island here, Wolf. I see the Aurora. Can I get the multi-purpose room in the Aurora? Is that a wise thing to do? Welcome aboard, Captain. All right, I'll stop screwing around now. You're saying over there? Northwest? I mean, I can certainly go northwest. Just one. No, all right. Continuing Northwest. So Brandy, how far into the game are you? Sounds like you're further along than I am. Oh, you haven't played it. Okay. Wow. You're fantastic, Lone Wolf. That island just appeared. Massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify. I gotta go over there. All right. Brandy Torres, thank you for the sub. Tree. 
Wow. I think I'm going to carve a little bit more of this tree after I, well, consume that one. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's perfect. Now I'll take one sample back. These like lights or something? That's cool. Uh, this isn't creepy at all. shit didn't like that huh yeah. and I can't catch a break anywhere can I Of course, I don't have an extra battery on me. Insert ion cube. I don't stop it. Huh? Die. Normally the sunbeam would have brought you here, but since there's two islands and I can't remember a damn thing, I got you here pretty early. Sorry. Okay. So I'm assuming that I can't do anything with this right now. And because I don't have a stupid flashlight. We have over here. Alien flora sample. All right. Whoa, it got dark out here. go there he is yeah. all right really wishing I'd brought another battery with me Oh, not going anywhere. This cave is pretty much a dead end. And 
few lights would be nice. Oh, what's this? Purple tablet. No idea what that is. I don't know if that's a small drop or a big drop. <laughs> Son of a gun. Oh no, they're gonna collide. I think I'll wait till it gets a little bit lighter out. All right, come on. Oh, it's ridiculous. I wonder if I can turn the gamma up. Nope. They're like, no, 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 you're done. This is how it is. Ah, here comes the sun. Ah, oh, much better. Didn't fix down in here at all. Yeah, I still don't know. All right, so we already came this way, so we need to go back this way and go down. And then over here. Whoa. Don't want to go that way. That just looks like death. Nope, this is right back where we were. Shit. <laughs> All right. up here now this is right back where we were too all right so we'll head down this way and then we'll go up here Another purple tablet. I should scan it.
That's two purple tablets. That's a bulb of tree. Where if I go down any further, I'm not going to be able to get back up. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, I'm screwed. There we go. Got it. And nothing up there. Okay. Well, it was worth a shot. Oh, there's something down there, though. Insert tablet. Scans indicate this structure is composed of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. No match is found in database performing structural analysis. Attempting translation. Okay, I know where that goes. Yeah, exactly. Let's touch it. <laughs> I'm guessing those were the, the what I was supposed to get out of here. I'm not seeing anything else. Wait a second. It's not going to give me the tablet back, huh? Oh, well. Because it did its job. Oh, look at this. Joseph Roberts, thanks for the sub. I certainly appreciate it. Thank you very much. That goes back up that way. Huh? 
Holding a mini nuke. All right, let's drop it. Yeah, that's a good thing to do. This green mineral, mineral substance has no entry in the periodic table. Unprecedented ability to store huge amounts of ionic energy within it, likely grown artificially. Cubic appearance suggests it's been cut from a larger deposit. Each cube contains the equivalent ionic energy of five kilotons of TNT. Under the right conditions, the energy could be released in a controlled manner, likely used as batteries, but would require a substantial power source to be recharged. Assessment, valuable energy source. Nice. Yeah. It's Fat Man. Oh, this is a different area. Yeah. All right, I gotta get one full oh, inventory full. Pshaw. I guess it's a big thing, huh? Oh, well. You know what? It's way too dark to be swimming down here. <laughs> Well, I don't want to swim back around the island. His sprinting seems so much faster. Here we go.
Um. Alrighty then. Ah, okay. Maybe it was like a Stargate kind of a thing, Sinclair. Everyone remember where we parked? Yeah, slave portal, see? Picking up multiple energy signatures on the island's surface. Sweet Lord, Voxel Shrub. Wow. Oh, let's drink some water. Yeah, no kidding. A Jaffa cup? How weird. And it's already getting dark again. Jesus. <laughs> okay. I could be falling off a cliff right now. I don't know. The Ming plant. Oh, because it looks like a Ming vase. All right. I'm with you. My inventory is full. And oh, that's a bulbo tree. Well, I could. Oh, that's what I could do. Actually, could I eat these? No, they're rotten. So I will drop these. And then I'm going to carve this one. And maybe a few more. It's a very slow way of eating. Plus eight at a time. But we're getting there. Oh shit, I just dropped it. There we go. All right. So we only need one sample of the rotten bulb bush. So we'll drop that one. Ming plant. Nope. Not edible. But we will take it with us. Okay. 
I have no idea where I'm going. You guys can probably see less than I can. <laughs> Yep. I'm just going to come park right up here and we're going to wait for daytime. Hey, uneasy? Think they'll just clip through the island? Your beacon did. Well, that's no good. It's dead. Yep. No worky worky. I like how the trees are like underlit. That's cool. So we got our scanner room. Still need the multi-purpose room. Scanner room speed upgrade. Scanner room range upgrade. All right, Sinclair, thank you for coming by. Um, I am streaming again tomorrow night. I'm not sure what I'm streaming. Normally, uh, Friday nights, I've been doing uh, Mass Effect 2. Sniper Elite 4. Heck, I may even be streaming this tomorrow night, so I'll have to figure that out. All right, cool, Lone Wolf. Could I? Oh, look at you. That's very smart, Uneasy. We could probably swap out any of these, huh? Oops, that's not what I actually wanted to do. There we go. Or we just wait until daylight. Ta-da! Look at that. We got it. Oh, don't go. See, look, I was that close to just dying. Yeah, we got to build them one of those too. Damn little spider things. Guessing we're going up there. Or over here. Did I get it? No. Stasis rifle. Nice.
required. New blueprint acquired. Integrating new PDA data. Potatoes are all we need. Life runs on potatoes. Look, you little shit. Come here. What's up, Carney? I'm just a skin and fool. Hey. All right. Spotlight. Got to skin that too. What else can we scan? Use ladder. Oh, that was fast. Integrating new PDA data. Oh, look, it's a battery. Let's pull this open. Exchange. Unload battery. Inventory full. Shisa. I guess I don't need a bunch of these uh, seeds, right? I can drop those. There we go. Integrating new PDA data. We didn't pick up the potatoes? Oh, shit. All right. I think I got everything out of here. Inventory. Oh, wait. I can R. Put that in. There we go. As, oh, because we need something big. There. Guess I can put that away. Oh, shit. Don't need that either. Those cluster trees. Like those? Like the palms or these? Oh, these. The lantern fruit. Of course, inventory is full. Inventory is really full. Do we need the gel sack?
you know what? I'm going to drop this battery. I know it sounds crazy, but I've got like four or five more at the house. So it's a big thing. So it takes up four slots. Because I have like two. Oh, here, let's... No, you just need lubricant for the moon pool. Let's see here. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Yeah, see the aerogel? I have like six of those. Which is what you get when you combine the gel sacks with uh, the ruby or something like that. My God, there's so much stuff to build. <laughs> but hey, it looks like I can build the ultra glide fins when we get back to the house. So uh, when we get back, let's build a platform, then put an exterior grow bed and start growing the bulb. A few other things need the indoors grow bed though. All right. So what should I drop? The lithium? I certainly don't want to drop the gold. The Ming. All right, dropping the Ming. Whoa, whoa. That was weird. All right. So now are we hiking up the mountain? Do we need to go up there? Can we go up there? Probably could just walk up there, huh? <laughs> New blueprint acquired. Oh, there's another one over there? Shit. All right. That's cool. Oh, I don't want to fall down.
We could use that. There we go. The home we go. Oh, yeah, you said it was at the ass end of the uh, the ship. You weren't kidding. All right, so that's everything we need here then. I just gotta find my way back to the Stargate. That doesn't give you seizures. I don't know what will. This wasn't the right way. I ain't swimming. That's for damn sure. <laughs> yep. And we'll have to do it another night because it is 1215 and I have work in the morning. But we need to get home first. I'm not going to leave this sitting here like this. That's for damn sure. I have no idea if I'm even headed in the right direction. Probably not. Definitely not. No, I just made a big damn circle. Whoops. This way, maybe? Nope.
Oh, there's something over there, though. <laughs> yeah, no shit. Uh, and it didn't help that it was dark when we got over here. So it's not like I can... I know what the landmarks look like. Uh, at least we're getting to daylight again. You'd think that the alien overlords would have made this, yeah, would have made it easier to find. Vital signs stabilizing. Son of a bitch. <laughs> All right, I know that we came down from this way, didn't we? Oh, we we came down the mountain, didn't we? No, no, no. Swim. It's 2,500 meters away. Okay, so everything else is that way. Let's head this way. I love full damage.
That wasn't the right way to go. <laughs> Looks familiar, I guess. Wonderful. All right, and uh, Commander Carney uh, with the two ninety nine super chat. Just in case Johnny says, "I want my two dollars." Thank you for the super chat, there, Carney. Hope you're having a good week. This is ridiculous. What is that? Oh, an ancient floater. Yeah, I know. All right, um, shit. Okay, we've gone that way. We've come from that way. We've gone that way. I think we've gone all the ways. Shouldn't have wandered. Yeah, we may have to. Oh, wait a minute. Is that a cave? Hold the phone. what I found. Let's get the hell off this island. Calorie intake recommended. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Home Jeeves. <laughs> I 
Oh yeah, we should be able to make it there before we starve. I'm working on it. I'm seeking it straight ahead. It's 900 meters away. I don't even know what it is. So Where the hell did my marker go? There it is. Wow. That's horrible. There. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, it is pretty cool car. It's a very different uh, survival game. All right, let's grab one of those really quick. And we'll consume it. Hey, four. The Aurora. Flotation device is active, but we've got some big old fish in the water with us, and I don't know how long we're gonna last. We're close to the crash site, so bring radiation protection. Four out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Of Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. They're always corrupted. You guys notice that? Yep. All right. I'm going to go down here. I need food. Hold on. Let me grab these guys really quick. Come here. Oh, inventory's full. Shit. Welcome aboard, Captain. I'm not dropping off much here. All right. Emergency. Starvation imminent. Seek calorie intake immediately. <laughs> That's right. All right. Now I can grab some fish. Come here, peeper. And want a second one. And a third one. I would just hate to start the game like starving. That would suck. Vital signs stabilizing. There we go. Ah, so much better. All right, guys, that is going to wrap it up. It is 1230, seven hours I've been streaming this game. Wow. 
<laughs> oh, I know. Two of them are empty. But we will. T I will deal with that tomorrow. It is 12.30 in the morning, and I have to be up at 6.30. So it means I'm going to get about five and a half hours of sleep. But I want to thank everyone, and um, welcome, Georgie. Um, sorry that you came in so late. But, um, yes, I'm glad you caught it as well, Carney. We will be doing this more. A matter of fact, I will, I, I you know what? I'm just going to call it now. We will be streaming this, uh, tonight. Well, because it's 1234 now. So Friday night streaming this same time, 530 PM central time. So, uh, tune in when you can. And I want to thank everybody, uh, all the new subs that we got tonight. Uh, Carney, thank you for the 299 super chat. Appreciate that. And, uh, Johnny, um, can, um, no, he ain't getting his two bucks. Screw him. <laughs> and guys, thank you very much. And until next time, you take care of yourselves. This is Draco Invictus saying this has been the greatest day in my life. See ya.